Scottish Island Peaks Race 2023, a multi-day sailing and fell running adventure race. And what an adventure it was. It was all calm at the race HQ when we signed on the night before. Almost too calm. We wouldn't be going anywhere fast if the winds didn't pick up. Just uh, here getting some practice in our little inflatable kayak, um, which we'll be using to row from um, the shore to the yacht. Um, it feels fucking really steady on well. It feels really um, unsteady actually. I'm quite worried <laughs> about the potential for um, capsizing. Wish me luck. Whoa! Just uh, finished the first run on Oban, a little 6k opener um, to stagger the start and then a little kayak to the yacht, which we've just climbed on board now and uh, we are at sea. This is um, going to be home for the next couple of days. Um, there's Will in his horrific pink split shorts. Um, dear, oh dear. We're on board the elixir of lawn. Here's our team. There's Will and Andy the skipper, and there's Mark and Alex. Mark is joking to Alex that he's been grooming me. I'm not sure what for, but I'm up for it anyway. Hey guys, Joe here. We are about 17 and a half kilometers into the Mull run. We're just about to start the final steep pull up to the summit of Benmore. Um, so, um, and hopefully it should all be downhill from there. Um, never is though, is it really? Uh, it's always something Something shit comes along to surprise you. Um, she didn't expect. A bit like what happens in life, a lot of the time, really. Uh, 
Bye for now. Approaching Benmore. Top of Ben Moore without incident. Um, onwards. Six six. A sailing road to the side of Scotland. We are currently the first to our place. And um, six six from the water. Six, 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 six. Currently travelling at a speed of six point seven knots. Making good time. Gosh, I'm wrecked. We're currently becalmed. Would you say this is what the calm does? I would say so. Yes, it's the calm. There's no wind, like so. We're just sort of trying to get to Jura. Alex is uh, rowing the boat. Look at him. Absolute Viking. <laughs> Total oarsman. Um, do it for the wind. Doing it for the wind. We're in a good place. If we can get over there. Hopefully the wind will pick up and take us out a bit quicker. What's going on here then, Mark? Well, we want you to win this race. So we're trying to do oh, everything in our power yeah. to do that. Fair enough. We've pressed, we've gone into attack mode. Really? <laughs> we've got yeah, the, the atomic bomb of Alex on the, the stern. He's still going for it, by the way. Look at that. Alex is super strong. Absolute Trojan. See, yeah. it's a job just picking the perfect lines. Yeah. <laughs> See, Will's really uh, putting a shift in as well. Uh, look at him. Matt, you pinch it on the left hand side. Yeah, there. Look at that. <laughs> look at that. He's done that before. I thought he'd retired. Yeah. <laughs> and then I thought I'd retired as well, being Steve, Steve Redgrave, but turns out I'm still required. Yeah, alive and kicking. Uh, successfully landed at Jura, had our kit checked, and we are on our way. Um, short little section of road, and then uh, we'll be heading up into the mountains. So, um, yeah, wish me luck. Will forgot his shorts, so he's uh, running in um, boxer shorts. Um, this is what they look like anyway. Me. Can't stand the sight of Will's shorts. I need to get ahead of him. Ahead of us there is Bain Achulish, which is Gaelic for Hill of the Narrows. That's our first mountain. And then we'll be going down, climbing up to the second one there, which is Bain Anor, which is the mountain of gold. Um, we are currently first in our class. So as it stands, we are going for gold ourselves. Which is good, isn't it? So there's three already. So we're fit for the sun.
approaching Bain Hianti, which in Gaelic means the sacred or holy mountain. Um, I've got about a 300 meter climb at the top, and then that's the last mountain on Jura done. I wonder if uh, Rene Domal was inspired by the holy mountain when he wrote the surrealist classic Mount Analog, which I recently had a conversation with my father about. He's dead, so we'll, uh, we can't ask him. Hey guys, Joe here. Um, just back on the yacht after a little run on Jura. Um, felt pretty good on the climbs. Um, descents were super technical, super rough ground. And um, because it was all just on-site navigation for us, we didn't really know any of the good lines. So we probably lost a bit of time on there. <clears throat> but overall, in a pretty good position, still first in class, and maybe like seventh or eighth um, overall. Um, so now we've got a super long sail to Aaron on the mother of Kintyre. Um, so I'm going to try and get some food in me, get my head down for a bit, and um, fingers crossed we have the favourable conditions over and out. How's it going? Oh, brilliant. Loving it. <laughs> Fresh water. Terrible. But the wind's not looking too great, is it? Nah. Put the kites up. Wait. <laughs> the asymmetrics up. Come down. I lay awake thinking about the day. I felt a bit bad for making fun of Will's shorts. I hope he wasn't upset and saw the funny side of it. Like a PG Woodhouse story, where Jeeves asks Bertie Wooster if he's wearing them because he'd lost a bet at the Drones Club or if they were planted in his suitcase by one of his enemies. Of course, true panache is all about doing what you want to do, wearing what you want to wear, and always just being yourself. Um, totally died off again, so Alex is out the back rowing. Um, yeah, we are about to pass Spirit of Maine in the uh, distance there. We were, the guys had got us up in the third place in the night. Um, we shipped a couple of those positions um, because of the tide and the wind or whatever. But uh, so we're into six or seventh now, I think. So. Yeah. Still leading our class though. So. kilometers in to the run on Aaron, starting the climb to Goatfell um, after nearly 22 hours at sea. Epic sail from Jura to Aaron. Yeah, Andy Allen and uh, Andy Alex and Mark did a brilliant job on the boat there. Amazing. Um, 
So yeah, got about five kilometers to go at the summit and then yeah, see what happens after that. We're just on the final little stretch up to the summit of Drogfell, the final mountain of the Scottish Island Peaks race. Um, the weather's been a wee bit dreek, um, but we've climbed pretty strongly. Will has pushed me all the way. Um, let's see how we get on on the descent. And uh, yeah, nearly done. Over and out. That's it. Summit of Godfell. Um, Will's just readjusting his shoes putting the insole back in, which has slipped out. Um, always happens on Saturdays. So um, if you're a person who um, gets uh, by Saturdays and can relate, then um, leave a comment in the uh, comments board. And don't forget to smash like and subscribe. Oh look, there we are, the elixir of lawn. And there's Alex on the stern rowing away trying to get us past Excalibur. Come on, Alex. Hold on, I'll find out. Yeah, find out. Feels like I'm not really contributing. Yeah, if you want to stop, well, now's probably it. Back on the yacht now. I'm um, sailing the Troon. Wind was pretty light. So, um, we all had to take a stint rowing. We've picked up a little bit of breeze now, so hopefully they'll hold and uh, get us back to the mainland. Um, Aaron was really good as always. Um, special place in my heart for him after a uh, coming of age geography trip uh, at school once. I uh, learned a lot and uh, had a nice time getting off with Hannah Holman and uh, holding hands at the back of the bus, listening to the new Blur cassette tape. I did ask Will if he wanted to recreate certain parts of the trip with me, but um, he didn't seem that keen. Um, so I'll I'll ask the rest of the lads and see what they think. Uh, anyway, we'll be done. Well, that's nearly it. We've picked up some good wind and we're on our way to Troon. It really has been one of the best weekends of my life. We set off from Oban nearly 60 hours ago, sailed over 170 nautical miles, ran over 100 kilometers, climbed nearly 5,000 meters. But best of all, made some really great friends and had a lot of really great laughs. Thanks, guys. Final little run, the race along the pontoons. Hey, hey, hey. Thank you. Bye for now.